Good evening. I forgot that my mic was muted. So welcome to the new update. And I come to you with great news. I linked my bow. It is not that optimal, but it has around 800 DPS ish. Um, I just crafted the cheap percent. Um, it is ideally I would remove the stun duration and get like attack speed or crit multi on it. Probably attack speed. That's quite slow. And I unveiled it or crucible it. And um, of course, it has a really, really bad first node. Um, great. So I'm just going to take you along for the right to hopefully replace it with this node, which is less damage, but overall better. Um, so far, all my attempts have been really bad at um, smelting stuff down. I just want the same tree as this one. I want the 15% explicit and the pen. But that has not happened so far. So, basically settling for something usable. And, yeah, the most efficient way of doing this one is to run through to the end with the crucibling and then see how many monsters you want to kill. Um, depending on the mods, that might or might not be possible. Yeah. So, the one you want to destroy at the top and the bottom double check contains forge that doesn't say what items are corrupted. So, so weird stuff. Um, this animation takes really long. You can skip it, of course. You can just close the window and check your inventory. A new instrument and I did not hit it. Great. Great. Perfect, almost. Al almost perfect. Hate it so much. Um. Yeah, so there's that. Um. There's also a unique opportunity in there, so I'm just gonna take a fun unique that I have lying around and put that in. Um. You might have noticed I. I've swapped away from um, from totems, um, which just makes it feel smoother and way, way less cluttery to play. Uh, technically, totems is more damage. Oh, it's a boss. I hope I can kill him. Um, he's really janky and annoying because of this bubble. Uh, cool. I am currently looking for a boot upgrade and gloves upgrade and helmet upgrade. Um, since I've also done my jewels and my chest and my bow is now technically done. I just have to get a good tree. Um, oh, another boss. So this is with the old bow, and I don't really have issues killing these, uh, bosses in here, right? So it's working. I don't know if that's a good or bad highlighting of the build. Can I call it, please? Um, yeah, for a short time I tried to use the unreserved mana that I had um, to get like a banner in the build. But it turns out that um, the mana region isn't enough to sustain um, mana forged arrows. 
um, with less mana than this. Um, so this is really comfy and fully automated. What did I hit on here? Big red orbs, iron reflexes. They're all so bad. Yeah, so an annoying thing now is that I have to unveil a lot of a lot of bows and they're all bad and so far I have just not hit anything good. This one is okay and I want the double damage mod maybe. Um but yeah, I also started running lower level maps to maybe speed up the process. Wait, where where, where did I put my, my bow? I'm so scared to just vendor it. Um I still have to keep it around and stuff. Um, yeah, uh, my sixth link um, is probably going to be inspiration. Um, not set on that yet. I did more heisting, did not find anything good, but I found a normal Heres. Um, that was fun. Uh, can't really use it because I'm relying on this amulet for all of my attributes um maybe the reforging of my boots gloves and helmet can help with that um because i just need better equip now um to do like end game content i'm done with uh like the atlas as a whole i'm only missing two unique maps at the moment and I started my first um, uh, my first attempt of Cyrus, and then Elder and Shaper. So I'm three for three for four on that, and started Shaper stuff. Um, yeah. Oh, leak specific guide. Yes. Let's go. Give me a headhunter. Mm, yeah. Other steps. I have this chest with a lot of chaos stress. It and and evasion and suppress. The thing is, I can't really lose any more other res, so I have to swap out all of my gear at the same time. When I swap stuff around, to swap all of it. There's no resistance on this ring. There's almost no resistance on this ring. There's no resistance on my amulet where you would normally look for resistance rolls. Um, my belt is still insane. Um, yeah, maybe I should just go to Rog and let him craft me. Yeah. What's happening here? Strength, cast speed, fire and cold damage upgrade. A small etched rune could have a beneficial sure. effect here. Yeah, so that's an insane ring. Um, and it's it's six tier one. I forgot about that. Cool. So, what do I want? They don't look good. A bit more stock. Those are technically boots. You want the premium deals, I see. Yeah, I want the premium deals. I want the good bases. Give me the good bases. Dragon scale. That's a good base. Um, and yeah, I have to change everything about this. So remove. Etched rune could have a beneficial. Yeah. Let's try to add more sockets to this. Ever put a sockets. I've of an entire vial of a few small runes in the right places. Could I recently received a five an entire vial okay. of black kind. You're an investor, I can tell. You have an eye for a long-term payoff. Wow. Interested? A bit. More um. Strong. Yeah. So basically, I'm looking at. Almost all the avenues, um, and I am running, as I said, another mana forge setup in here. It's burning arrow because it has the highest 
uh, effectiveness of added damage. Um, so compared to Ice Shot, Ice Shot is... Or, or, or is it? I lost the line. Uh, 174. Um, and Burning Arrow was 295. It's wild. Um, I just proc that instead of placing down totems and letting them die and stuff. I think my tree hasn't really changed. I got Aspect of the Eagle in. Now that I'm at level 96 again. Um, and swapped out some of my uh, Abyss Jewels for normal regular ones since my flat damage is so high that percentage increases are just better. Um, yeah. I think that's it for now. I hope that I get a tree that is usable and that I get rid of the stupid um, stupid cannot chill on this one. Maybe I should just run a torch to um, to get that off. I'll keep you updated. Um, thanks for watching and see you in a few days.